ultimately, he does give in, as Mark and Lisa partake in spiral stair sex. Interesting location. But more important things are going on, like Johnny buying his girlfriend some flowers. Yeah, can I have a dozen red roses, please? Oh, hi, Johnny. I didn't know it was you. What? Here you go. That's me. Huh? What? The? How much is it? It'll be $18. Here you go. Keep the change. What? what? Hi, doggy. You're my favorite customer. What? Thanks a lot. Wait. Bye. Bye-bye. Okay, hold on. What just happened? I mean, I know he's just buying her some flowers, but I think they were reading the script backwards or something. In fact, let's analyze this scene. I mean, I know I'm nitpicking, but this whole 20 seconds really fascinates me. Yeah, can I have a dozen red roses, please? Oh, hi, Johnny. I didn't know it was you. You didn't know it was him? You didn't recognize the five-foot, girly-haired French zombie until he took off his sunglasses? Here you go. That's me. Why did he say that? She didn't give him any reason to say that. Is that just his random catchphrase of the day? How much is it? It'll be $18. Here you go. Keep the change. Hi, doggy. You're my favorite customer. Thanks a lot. Bye. And what was up with the rushed pace of that last couple seconds? Did they only have enough money to rent the store for like two minutes so they had to shoot it really fast? Hello, I would like to buy a dozen roses. Hey, jackass! I'm closing the store in 30 seconds! Here's the money. Keep the change. Hello, don't you? You should like Johnny. I don't! You're a slut. Yes! What else is there to talk about? So Johnny and Mark sit down and have a talk with their other good friend, Peter. Hey, are you running, um, Beta Breakers this year? I am, sure. No, I'm not doing it this year. <laughs> chicken, Peter, you just a little chicken. Chip, 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 chip. This has been another pointless moment. I did not hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not hit her. I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. I did not hit her. It's not no, true. No, 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 don't play it again. I think the evidence is very clear. That is the worst piece of acting that has ever been put on film. I, I mean, my God! Not, not one inflection was right. Not one word was said correctly. Not one breath of air made me believe anything that he was saying. There are middle school plays that put on better performances than that couple of seconds. That was like the nirvana of bad acting. The holy grail. All hail to you, your lameness. I did not hit her. I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. My God, was that bad. Football? Oh, great. I'll go put on my finest tux. Oh, wait. No, no, no. I'm getting married tomorrow, so uh, I got to iron out my jersey. We got a new client at the bank. We'll make a lot of money. What client? I cannot tell you. It's confidential. Oh, come on. Why not? No, I can't. Anyway, how is your sex life? Can't talk about it? Why not? Why not? How about you just brought it the fuck out of nowhere, you weird alien man? Is he dead? 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 Well, yes. Yes, he is, young lady. He has passed on. This person is no more. He has ceased to be. He's expired and gone to meet his maker. He's a stiff, bereft of life. He rests in peace. If he didn't shoot himself, he'd be pushing up daisies. His metabolic processes are now history. He's off the twig. He's kicked the bucket. He's shuffled off the mortal coil. Run down the curtain and join the friggin' choir invisible. This is an ex-person! Well, I'd better replace it then.